guys and today i'm going to be doing another star wars review because i can't and i can't want to really bad so i'm on my little webcam and it, i forgive you for the quality but this is what we got to do this is what we can deal with so here we go um so i don't own many of the vintage kenner ewoks i own some but not a lot of them so i wanted to do this quick little review and you can forgive me i have a cold so kind of shitty but that's all right so i was very selective with the ewoks i chose i basically have the ones that are kind of, you know, the more common ones. And then I skipped out on the ones that are like, you know, the last 17 ones that are like $50. And I don't want to spend $50 for a little brown teddy bear with a stick. No, not happening. So, um, I'd rather buy last 17 Amanda Man or something like that. So, um, this is, these are my Ewoks. So I'll start maybe order of release. So, Chief Chirpa and Low Grey were the first ones. And then later they made Wicket. And Tebow, that was part of the Wave 2 Ewoks. And then they made Poplo and Rombo, which were kind of the swing ones, I think, or something like that. And then they made Warwick and Lumat for Last 17, if I recall. I don't remember. But, uh, so this is Chief Chirpa. Um, I just picked him up recently at a Star Wars convention, so he is quite mint. Um, as you know, this guy is definitely the easier ones to find. Low Gray is one of the easier ones to find, and he's quite nice. Nice gray detailing. Nice little, but yeah. He's kind of a angry little fella, isn't he? Yeah. Um, but um, he does come with this little stupid... S that's not his... Yes, it is. Okay. So I can guess myself again. That's his stick. He looks like a little bone. So yeah, there's Chief Chirpa, leader of the Ewoks. Next, this one is Logre. And you know, the first couple ones just all seem to have this really angry... Let's get this... But they all seem to have this, like, really angry face. Like, why? Why do they have that angry face? I do not know. But yeah, Low Gray was kind of nice. And they never, they never seem to get the color right because he's... This one, this one's pretty nice. But the recent vintage collection one made him look too brown. And I didn't like that. But this one's quite nice. Striped. This is one of the first Ewoks. He's pretty cool. He's got his little handbag and his little tribesman stick. I think he's the Menace Man or something like that. So there's that one. Uh, finally, we have, for our Wave 1 Ewoks, I don't have Wear Wicket, because it just, ugh, he's $25, and I don't want to pay that much for one that's not even, like, big and chunky, like, these guys are, he's like a little tiny midget, and I don't want that. Stupid. But this one is Tebow, and for the life of me, I can't get this stupid weapon to fit in his dumb hand. Like, it's, look, it's ridiculous. It's th thicker than his hand is, so he can't ever hold it, and it just puts his off but yeah there it is i got it whatever screw it but he does come with this stupid little you know x there stupid whatever um but yeah he's quite nice i like him quite cool uh he's got some nice detail on his cap this is definitely one of the better ones and by way too they smartened up and they gave him a neutral looking face it doesn't really look like tebow that much it, they kind of got it wrong but you know what it's bad but why don't the heads turn ever one of that but Finally, we own the la the only last 17 Ewok that I managed to acquire or wanted to buy in that matter. And that is Pop Low. <laughs> if he just... Whatever. Th there he is. He's quite nice. He's the last 17 Pop Low. Kind of a rare figure to come by. Oh my god, that was terrible. But anyway, my this is the staff. It's... This little stupid thing can set you back, like, 50 bucks alone. This stupid little thing, which I really hate. But, uh, and it doesn't seem like he wants to put it in his hand either. There we go. Quite nice. I think he's my favorite Ewok. I just like him. I don't know why. Played by Kenny Baker, also, in the movie. Quite cool. He's the stupid one that, like, gets on the speeder and stuff like that or whatever, but quite prominent. So, yeah. So, those are my Ewoks. Um, I don't own many of them, but they are quite cool, and I like them a lot, so... Um, I only, I'm very selective about which ones I want, so I only have a couple, but I will see you guys later, and I want to know what other group of stars figures I should review, so I'll see you guys later, bye.